What is up, Evil Dead fans? In this video, I'm going to talk about the Knights of Samaria and the meetups. Now, we have done meetups from the Knights of Samaria Facebook page for the last four years at Rosemont, Illinois, in Chicago, a flashback weekend. And unfortunately, this last year, this fourth year, was the last year that it's going to happen. Uh, just because of things and schedules, it's, it's, it's the end. Uh, Chris Pollock, I want to thank him first and foremost for putting this together every year. Every year he does. And he's done an amazing job and he has other things he needs to worry about. And it's much appreciated. And I'm sure that everybody who's ever been to one would agree that he has done an incredible job with it. So, there has been other KOS meetups in other states, other things, and all you have to do is simply just put something out there that you are part of that group and you want other members to show up. It has happened before in different states, which is very cool to see, but for this specific group, this era that Chris has put together of these members, it's at an end. So, it's sad to see it go, but at the same time, I am very honored and privileged that I was there for all four years and Chris made that happen for me. So I wanna thank him for that. And I'm sure, again, other people would agree with that. So what this is, is a compilation of all four years, photos and videos of what we did. Now, if you were at one of these and you happened to not be in one of the photos or videos, it's just because I don't have that in my reel of photos and videos. So if anybody out there has any more of those, let me know and send them to me and I'll save them in my reel and I can make a part two to include you in this. So if you're not shown, it's that's the only reason. It's not like I'm trying to exclude people. So with that being said, this is the Knights of Samaria meetup at Flashback Weekend in Rosemont, Illinois from 2019 to 2022. Hey Brett, it's Roger from Ultra Effect Studios. Getting ready to do the grill pop. That's right. Check it out. Brett's Groovy Chainsaws. This is his shit right here, man. Isn't that cool? We're gonna have a good time, man. This is a spicy beer challenge. What's your company's name? So we got uh, the Ghost Scorpion. Hey, you want to try? Spicy beer. Let's try, man. What's right. spicy beer? Spicy beer, Brett. Challenge number one. It's got some sweetness to it, a little bit of spice. Let's see how this goes. If it's going to be a win or a bell. Vinny is also trying the challenge. I got a spirit. I got a drive. Fuck yeah, dude. Dig it. Brett's, Brett's going to for second. That's awesome. It's got that nice throat. <laughs> there you go. I see, I see it in his eye. It's not been here already. Oh, well, yeah, it's there, but it's not like it's there. Right. It's living here. It's good. Wow, okay, I'm impressed. I mean, what? 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 You're going to see it. 
All right. All right, it's let's really see. good for a beer. It's what really, really good. I'm a big Clamato fan. Yeah. And so I love it. I always see, spice I mine up. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah, but I'm not going to tear up or anything like that. But I'm a Clamato oh, fan. I spice mine up. So it's really good. All right. No, it's really good. It's not too hot, not too soft. It's really good. Oh, shit. Very impressive. Very impressive. It needs to go the right. Needs taste. to go with food. It needs to go with food. It's some kind of yo. It needs to be. That's not something you just drink. It goes with a meal. Yeah, you just drink. No, it goes with a meal. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> like hot wings. All right. Once again, let's see what we got here. Ghost scorpion. Nice. <laughs> Really? Well, this has been entertaining on my That's really good, man. I love it. It's delicious, yeah. Well, I'm not kidding. It's really, really good. Yeah. It's really good. See, when I get Kamada in Montana, it's spicy. Okay. Oh, yeah. yes. We are at Fuck Christian yeah. Peter's house right now. I don't know. I did like a mix of rock and roll and cowabunga. He's got that <laughs> sick ass garage in here. Like, that's a steel building. Yeah. Hey, get out of my shot. 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 Get the fuck out of my shot. Get out. Wait, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. wait. Fuck out of my I shot, right? What are you doing? I'm trying to film like here. Get out of my right shot. Get out of my shot, bro. This is my shot. Like, this is my shot. This is my I claim this space. This is my shot. Get out of here. You're, you're my safe space. You're in my space. Get out. I'm trying to film here, damn it. Get out of here! Scram! <laughs> I think I've recorded him more with his middle finger than anything else this week. Probably. <laughs> everyone has it on their middle fingers, it's like eh. Oh yeah, I gotta go get that ice. I gotta just kinda like sit here and look at it. So where'd you get some of your screenies stuff? All from either profiles and history. Hey, watch where you point that thing. That thing too. Yo, I just noticed your shirt. Last night slash early this morning, like around 4 a.m. It takes me a while to fall asleep. Chris comes barging in her and he's like I need a corkscrew. And I'm like, what the fuck do you need a corkscrew for? And he's like, me and Vinny are going to open this bottle. Why? And I'm like, no, you're not. I'm completely covered in blankets and pillows and sheets. And I was like, you're not opening a bottle of wine. He's like, why is that? And I was like, because you've had enough already. He's like, you're not entirely wrong. And I was like, just save the bottle of wine till tomorrow. And he's like, that's not a bad idea. And I was like, yeah, I know. And he's like, anyway, we got plenty of beer left anyway. We're just finished those. I was like, no, you won't. And he goes, <laughs> you look like a mummy wrapped in these those sheets. And I was like, yeah, I'll talk you if you try and get this bottle of wine. I was like, have fun. Do me a favor. Drink water. And he goes, can't make any promises. <laughs> and he walks out. That was, that was Chris this morning. <laughs> Fake news! Get Mr. out of here! Mr. Hamilton! Get out of here! Rumor is you like Army of Dark. Get out of here! <laughs>
Hey bud, it's dark here. It's Chris, you know Chris. I know it's still light out there, but I wanted to say hi to you. You know, I told him you gotta to talk to my little buddy. So I wanna say hi, and I want you to do me a favor. I want you to give Brody a hug for me. And, and tell your mom says hey, and your brother. Yep, miss you bud. We'll see, I'll, see you, I'll see you Monday. That's Ryan. Yeah, you don't know me, but you should, because I rock. That's Josh. No one. Oh yeah, we out here at Flashback Weekend with the KOA. <laughs> I can't do any more than that. Went into the bathroom to grab my penis, you know. I realized my fingertips were too large. I couldn't grip the me <laughs> Listen here, brother. The best wrestler ever created. Listen here, brother. Listen here, brother. <laughs> We all just started. I found my real brother. Brother. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, grab oh, it. We're still going? Yeah, grab it. Somebody <laughs> grab it. All right. Graham, do it. Do it. The whole cold oh, Yeah, no. I ain't talking about Hogan. Yeah. Yeah. Mega powers don't exist oh, anymore. Oh, How could you say that? that? We're down oh, here. Gotcha. This big weekend was in the urinal. Yeah, this is the size of an ice cube. Don't really understand the little jizz spot. Yeah, throw the soap on your hands. Brother got nasty in there. Oh, yeah. yeah. Little thing toilet paper. Yeah, my fingers took right through it. Uh, yeah, right in the butt. And that soap. Oh, man. What do you think about that? All weekend long, touching your own brown eye. Little rusty eye. Or, or, I don't know, but yeah. A, a little tickle once in a while really helps out. Uh, well, anyways, really helps out the Mean Gene yeah. Okerlund here. What's your thoughts on uh, Hogan and the, the recent match? Are your, uh, what? <laughs> I don't want to hear anything about Hogan here. It doesn't matter what he's good. Are you Hogan? Are you Hogan right now? Where's that? Are you Hogan? Are you? Oh, yeah. Oh, this guy right here. That! That's what I'm talking about, yeah. Hogan, old clean cut, looking nail, yeah, little hair, plants on top, don't really get it. Guaranteed. Came from a spot in his sack, maybe a little bit of the gooch. Tony Schiavone, what's your thoughts? My name's not Tony Schiavone. <laughs> More like Jabroni. <laughs> don't like the way you're talking. I don't like the way you're talking as well. What are you going to say about that? Open a can of whoop ass on you. Uh, big old can of whoop ass. Yeah, how big is that can? Is it size of a Campbell's or size of a Vegas sausage? Something a little small with a little pull tab. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Gets the job done. <laughs> Gets the job done, yeah. Put a little tab off, grab one of those little wieners. Yeah, put it right in your mouth. Yeah, tastes good on a Sunday afternoon right at the church. <laughs> All right. Uh, Chris, Chris, I got a gift for you tonight. Uh, here you go. And yeah, it's a little late for that. If you want some of that, <laughs> take a whiff. It's maybe brown sugar. I'm good with your brown sugar. <laughs> 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 Save that for the point star. Oh God! <laughs> no. The crazy thing is that lube. His finger's been on that, and that finger's been on somebody's butt. That is not true. <laughs> <laughs> You want to take a whiff of that tube? No thanks. Who's got a corkscrew? Me and Vinny right. need to open this bottle of wine. My Facebook wall as well. Too. I got you. All right. So it was, was it actual flashback or was it when we were just hanging out last year? Just hanging year? out. So flashback didn't happen because of, you know, what happened in the pandemic last year, but we all got together anyway because, you know, a lot of people had already planned on coming out, paid for stuff, and, you know, we love each other, and we know how to hang out and be safe and whatnot. Responsible, most of us. But <laughs> most of us, and this is where we get to the meat of the story, the reason why we're filming right now. It's late at night like this, probably even later, partying hardcore like they are, even more so. Mm -hmm. um, I was the youngest person in the group, but I took my happy black ass to the bed because I was like, I'm tired. I'm going to go get some sleep. Room is the exact same structure as this. I'm over there in that corner, laying down, and then all of a sudden I hear, Who's got a corkscrew? Me and Vinny need to open this bottle of wine. <laughs> and I'm like, 
I just peek out from around the covers. It's like, you don't need to open shit. You and Vinny have plenty of bottles of beer to finish drinking. He goes, all right, I guess you're right. <laughs> just walks off. And so... <laughs> <laughs> so the Ooh. next the next day I forgot why that story came up but like I told him and Brett was Brett was just like you are he was dying laughing I still got the original recording of that because <laughs> we went to breakfast with a bunch of other people and like they were talking about how drunk everyone was including Chris I was like yeah that was good Chris came in, he's like, Me, who's got our corkscrew? <laughs> Me and Vinny need to open this bottle of wine. <laughs> You're not going to give me a corkscrew? All right, I guess I'll go to that. He's crying. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm gonna find that original recording. You gotta watch the original. What are you doing? What are you doing? Where is it? Where is it, Pablo? Did you put... I can feel it on my foot. <laughs> <laughs> it's not on your foot, so I don't know what that is. Oh, wait, it is your foot. Oh, get it, Pablo. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Mindy. You think you're funny. Damn, that didn't work. You he suck. thinks he's funny. Oh, by the way, he said there's already furries lined up at the convention center. Oh, yeah. I'm not going. <laughs> I better uh, take this Clickers Edition Evil Dead from 97.98 and uh, take off this $10 price tag sticker. Man, it's in great condition. Yeah. I didn't rewind it. Like Man, yeah. This case is really good shape too for being from 97 98 <laughs> that's all i gotta say where'd you get that my friend brought it <laughs> i figured that's what you were trying to do right <laughs> that's i just hey, Doug. <laughs> Like fiberglass go over the fucking hard stuff. Hey, Barry. Yeah, this is. Ah, Jewish. Space car was red. If I recall correctly. Here, 
Rosie from the Rose fucking her, she Rose can't her read. dead son from the grave. We, 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 we get Art here spilling the truth. Art here spilling the truth. All they can do, all she can do is try to raise this deadite type child, which in turn makes her absolutely insane. Which brings her to 1980 or 79, I guess, Camp Crystal Lake, where she kills the cancelers and she's talking to herself. It's like, okay, if we can justify the fact that Jason comes back at part two, then he should have been alive the whole time with the Necronomicon, and it just drove her up the fucking wall. But how would she have translated that, though? That's the big whole thing. Details. Yeah. Exactly. Hey, hey, hold that cool. glass up, Pierce. Hold that glass up. I'm on it. He's got school, son! <laughs> Get out of here! You're terrible at this! Take there's Necronomicon for dummies, right? No, you're thinking of Voodoo for dummies. There's witchcraft for dummies. It's called a Necronomicon. You're gonna tell me the dude yeah. from the, bo the I, dollar store. Everyone knows Sumerian. I mean, exactly. Yeah, every, yeah. Did you flunk Sumerian 101? Listen, you, you don't need to know about my college degrees. Fuck Sumerian. you. See, this is why people should have died in that movie Terrifier. Just, just bring up that conversation, then they're... Uh, bad luck. They all have bad luck. <laughs> <laughs> so, Paris. So, yes. You just got schooled, son. Y'all can go fuck yourselves. Jason's not a deadite. <laughs> Jason's a deadite. It's canon. Yeah. Yep. And one canon. movie. I'll, I'll concede for that one movie. I don't know about you, Ham, because I think I saw a... <laughs> I don't know, uh, Book of the nice. Dead? I think I saw Book of the Dead for Evil Dead 2. Alright, then I'll hit you with this, right? Movie. Here, yeah, I'll hit man. you with this. I'll hit you with this. This is the way I personally see it, right? And guess who, guess who translated? The yeah. Gremlins. The Gremlins? <laughs> <laughs> the Gremlins resurrected Jason. That's not no, the No, the, the Gremlins, two Gremlins. Yeah, yeah, from Warner <laughs> Brothers. Totally did it. The one with the glasses. Yeah! Absolutely. Oh my god. Yeah, but uh, here's my I, here's the reason why oh, I say the book is about right. The news ain't planted a dead body in the fucking house, right? That was the Got first thing it. he said. He said okay. I planted this body in the house to make a better story. Who's to say this fucker didn't read up on the occult and think, huh? A book with skin on it. Who won? How would that not make a great story? So he slapped that shit on there too. That to me makes more sense. Dude, okay, you're going too deep here. Yeah, that's the whole yeah, point yeah, of yeah. it. You're, you're, so, you're, 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 you're getting away from the script. So, a book. From the script. so wait, 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 Paris. You're yeah. talking about a book that's bound in human flesh. Exactly. And inked in human, but like the Necronomicon yeah. ex mortis. He made a fake one by reading from the occult, and he bullshitted one together, and it was planted in the house to make a better story. That is the way I see it. Nah, that's the Necronomicon, buddy. Yeah, no bullshit, buddy. No, I'm that means Sam Raimi himself. Oh, I'm trying to find that you a knife. Oh, all right, all right, get him. Get him. I got you a knife. Get him. <laughs> all right. Fine, y'all, y'all, y'all want to fight? Fine, let's fight. Let's fight. Oh shit! Let's fight! Come on! Come on! <laughs> Somebody do something, please. Oh my god! Oh, Peter's turned into Doctor Zoidberg from Future Robert. <laughs> <laughs> Tiny fries over here. I got cotton mouth. <laughs> Sick attack! So there it is. The Knights of Samaria meetup at Flashback Weekend in Rosemont, Illinois from 2019 to 2022. I want to thank everybody for joining us for this experience and also for Chris Pollock for everything he's ever done because he goes above and beyond. Christian Peters as well for having us over for an evening back in 2020 and showing us a lot of his props and feeding us. It was a great time. Now, again, anybody can have these meetups. You just have to put that out there that you want to do this. You don't have to pay for everything. You don't have to set up rooms. All you have to do is say, hey, I want to meet up with the Knights of Samaria members. And if you ask, a lot of times they'll show up. But with that being said, will there ever be meetups again with the OG members of these past four year meetups. Hmm. Is there something that I put on? Hmm. There is. <laughs>